Hey everybody, we're Pokemon. Let's go ahead and finish up the SSN and then we can get on probably with the gym. And there's a few other things that I need to do along the way. Um, but let's go ahead and, um, um, fairy people cost water. Um, small trees can be chopped down using the move cut. Remember this, cut is an HM technique. Once learned, it is not easily gotten. I totally forgot which doors we went in last time, but I'm pretty sure we haven't gone in any of these doors just yet, so... Yeah, partly because we have to fight them. Which do you find more worthy, a strong or a rare Pokemon? Well, why not both? Alright, he's got two. I'm guessing one's gonna be strong, one's gonna be rare. Let's take a look. I'd consider Growlithe pretty rare. Sorta. I mean, I can't get in this game considering it's a version exclusive, but... He's also probably gonna, like, smash me. Leer? Okay, that's fine. You can lower my defense, it's not a big problem. Let's do... Wing attack. How much will that do? Okay, about the same as Gust. Ooh, hey! We get we get some more X, XP and he just brought in someone that's actually good? Ooh, oh, but I'm paralyzed, I forgot about that. I need to unparalyze War Turtle. Okay. Hey, and War Turtle is now 28. Cool. Okay. Um, Ponyta. Yeah, let's go ahead and change this because he's paralyzed. I can bring in, go ahead and bring in Needle King for um, just a little while. Now, let's go ahead and do that. And that is a Pokemon that we haven't seen just yet, so that's another new one. Okay. Um, yeah. Not much of a problem there. I must salute you. And we got hella money. Right away. I don't believe I saw you at the party. I probably didn't. Not, not much of a partier. Alright, last dawn. What do you got? Radita? Alright, that'll be pretty easy to take down for Pidgeot. Actually, maybe not. Let's do a wing attack. Okay, good. Good. I like, you love to see it. Pikachu. Let's go ahead and bring out War Turtle. See what War Turtle can do. Hmm. Could use Water Gun. Tail Whip. Okay, it's not the most. It's not the worst thing on the planet. I don't want to affect this too much. All right. Oh, really? All right. Let's let's go ahead and bring in. Let's, let's bring in Pikachu just so we can get a little bit of experience rolling here. Okay. And quick attack. Just to get some experience going. Oh, Pikachu's paralyzed. That's alright, I can, I can go heal in a little bit. Alright, we defeated Dawn. Take it easy. Oh, she gave me like no money. Uh, okay. Well, I'm gonna need to come back and because that Pokeball is currently stuck. Found X attack. Okay, that is not particularly useful. How many door? How many doors we got? We got two more doors. Are these both fights? You, my daddy, think the Safari Zone is awesome. I wish we could go there again. Have you gone to the Safari Zone in Fuchsia? No, but I'm actually pretty excited for it because I do know there are some pretty rare Pokemon there that I want. Oh. Okay, the captain said he's awfully sick. He's all pale. I hear many people got get seasick. Okay, so we got the two stairways to go up, but real quick, before we do any of that, I'm gonna go ahead and heal, just because I don't feel like doing all this. With two paralyzed Pokemon. Yeah, let's go ahead and take a rest. Okay. And let's go ahead and move up. Oh, I can go this way too? Oh yeah, we're already here. What am I doing? Alright, let's go up the stairs. I guess we can go up this one first. Our captain is a sword master. They say he even teaches cut to Pokemon. 
That's pretty cool. Oh, I feel ill. I get seasick, so I stepped out. Oh, scrubbing decks is hard work. Ahoy there, are you seasick? I don't know we'd have a battle here. Alright. Sailor Trevor. Sorry, I like, got a text. Alright, Machop. Okay, um, probably do a gust here. Okay. Um, yes, I'm like totally being super engaging in the video right now. Pentacle? Yeah, let's go ahead and, um, bring in Weeping Bell. Should be a good matchup for Tentacool. Because they're both poison and grass is good against water. So we can go, go do a bullet seed. Bop. Oh, that is not very effective at all. Okay. Do two times. Okay, constrict. That's not good. Can I switch out? you kid party's over the ship will be departing soon hey maybe oh let's do a little jig okay who fights on board all right what do you got bud who oh same thing he's got him a chop we attack it's perfective love to see it Shelter? Nah, we'll just we'll keep Pidgeotto out for now. We attack. Supersonic, but you miss because you're garbage. Another wing attack. There we go. Easy peasy. Okay, I think that's everything we have up here. Okay, then we can go ahead and go up this one and see where this takes us. Is this the captain? Oh, I feel hideous. Ah, oh, seasick. Red rub the captain's back. Whew, thank you. I'm feeling much better. You want to see my hidden cut technique? Could show you my prize cut technique if I weren't so ill. I know you can have this, the hidden machine. Teach cut to your Pokemon and you can see a cut anytime. Cool. Using cut, you can chop down small trees. Why not try it with the trees on Vermilion City? Okay. We'll set sail soon. Farewell until our return to Vermilion City. Okay. Cool, so I guess he just he just gives us cut. Well, we got one more place to see, and then I'm also going to quickly Google everything about this boat just to make sure I don't miss anything on my way out. I know we have a staircase down here that we also need to go down. Okay, we got some more doors to open. Let's go. My buddy Machoke is super strong. He has enough strength to move big rocks. Found super potion. Okay, I literally just stole this kid's super potion with like absolutely no shame. Found hyper potion. That's a good item. Oh, two fights. Okay. Come on then. My sailor's pride is at stake. Alright, bud. There's gonna have just another Machop. Horsey. Wing attack. Aw, oh, come on, man. So close. Sorry, let's use quick attack. You shelter. Yeah, let's go ahead and change Pokemon. Bring in Needle King again. Gonna use thrash. There we go. All 
Alright, and he's about to use Pentacool. We'll go ahead and stay with uh, Nido King for now. Just thrash. Yep, pretty easy. I gotta watch out though. Need well, actually, we're gonna go to the gym right after this, so. I just wanna make sure they don't go above 30. Okay, another fight. You know what they say about sailors and battling. No? I mean, not particularly, bud, but. One Pokemon. Shelter. It's gonna be. Is it, why do they at least, like, bring out a cloister? Like, come on, man. You got a single shelter? Alright, let's go ahead and attack it. Ooh, withdraw. Fence Rose. Okay, that's fine. Let's do a Gust. Okay, that's worse. Okay, noted. Okay. How many? One, two, three. Okay, we got three more to go through. Battle right away. I feel feisty. I, I like feisty kids like you. And these people have some weird interactions with kids, man. Alright. Let's go ahead and do a wing attack. I'll probably switch out Pidgeotto out of the first slot just because he's getting very close to 30. Horsey. Yeah, let's go ahead and change it up. I'm gonna bring in Weeping Bell back in. I, I know Weeping Bell is kind of slow because Bullet Seed is just not a very good move right now, but let's try it. Let's try Acid. Oh, actually, not bad at all. Smoke Screen. Okay, accuracy fell. Do another Acid. Yeah, Acid did not work that terribly, actually. Nice. Okay, about to use horsey. No, we'll keep keep Weeping Bell out for a little long, a little while longer. Another acid. This man's just training up a bunch of horsies. There's smoke screen, which that's fine, but I don't think acid can miss. Never mind. Acid can miss. I literally just ate my words two seconds later. Oh, there's a cheese stick right there. I kind of want to eat it. All right, we defeated Sailor Dylan. All right, give me whatever item you got there, bud. So if you care less about the fight, give me this item. Found one ether. Okay. Get some PP rolling if we've run out. Okay, another fight. Even us sailors have Pokemon too. I bet you do, bud. I bet you do. Um. Okay. What do you got? Tentacle? Real quick, I'm just gonna pull up a little checklist to make sure. Not bad. And you sailors don't have a lot of money. Found a TM. Rest. Okay. It could be pretty good, I think, right? You would think. Ah, uh, two more battles, okay. Okay, I think that is everything. I I checked and it looks like we got we got all the items, so we did this, grabbed that. We, we did all the things upstairs, so I think we're all good to go. We are all set. Goodbye. And if I missed anything, you guys can make fun of me in the comments. With the SS gone... I was about to make a joke. The SS and is SS gone, but I totally just like... Wonderful. Alrighty. We gotta wait for the ship to pass by, because of course it is unsafe. Hope you had a good trip. Thank you. Oh, totally thought he was going to say something to me there. Okay, so we've got a couple of things to do. First of all, TM case, open. Cut, use. I think we can probably teach it to Needle King. Um, already has notes for moves just because. 
Um, poison sting. Yeah, we could probably get rid of poison sting here. So here's the thing. I'm gonna need cut throughout the entire game, and I'm going to be keeping Needle King throughout the entire game. Might as well give him cut. I know a lot of people have like an HM slave, but in this case, I'm really gonna try to incorporate my HMs in a Pokemon that I already want to use. So I think that's good. I don't think I have to. I don't have to. Rock Tomb. Needle King is able to turn Rock Tomb. We're not gonna teach these moves just yet, just because we don't really particularly need to, as of this moment. Okay. So, let's go ahead and heal our Pokemon, and then we've actually got something to do. I have a notepad up from last night. So, all the episodes, or most of the episodes up until now, have been over two days. Well, this is the first episode on my third day of playing. I have a little notepad here, so, um, I got cut. We hope to see you again. So, what we're gonna go ahead and do is, we're gonna come back. But we're gonna go back to Mount Moon, grab Clefairy, I gotta grab another Abra, I, and I have to trade. Do I, have, do I have an Abra with me? I do have my Abra with me. What item do you have? Let me take your item. Okay, we have made it out of the cave, if I can aim it right. So we come up over here, first thing we gotta do is go to this house. And we will go ahead and perform a little trade here. Oh, uh, wrong dude. I need to go to you. Looking for Pokemon and Abra. Trade one for Mr. Mime? Yeah, sure. Go ahead, take him. And I, I kept the Twisted Spoon because it's my Twisted Spoon. Okay. And do a little trade. And we get Mr. Mime. Maybe I should keep Mr. Mime in my party throughout the entire game. Maybe that's something we should do. So Mr. Pa Miss Mimey? Mr. Mime is pretty sick. Alright. Ourselves. Hey, thanks. Okay, no problem. I mean, you gave me the better Pokemon, so okay, bud. Okay, so where does this go? This tree looking to be cut. Would you like to use cut? Yeah, Needle King used cut. Go, Needle King. What is down here? Does this take me. Once a Pokemon learns Flash, you can get through Rock Tunnel. Okay. Where does this take us? Oh, we can get this Pokeball. Found Ether. Ether in items pocket. Ooh, more items. On a Paralysis Heal. Okay, so. I think that is everything. Let's go ahead and head back up. And now we gotta head through cave, trade with Abra. Um, I guess we can go check out the museum. Um, I don't know, I don't think we can do anything with the fossil yet. But, might as well check it out, because I don't, I don't particularly remember to be completely honest. Let's go ahead and, let's store Pikachu away, that's kind of sad. Let's store Mr. Mime away. Um, oh, I did not want to do that. Well, I guess he yeah, actually, that's good. Okay, so we gotta choose two Pokemon here. Um, who do we want to evolve? We gotta work on evolving a couple of them anyway. Okay, let let's go ahead and grab Spiro. And then, when does Sandshrew evolve? Evolution level twenty-two. Okay, let's go ahead and grab. Um, Spiro and uh, Sandshrew. Oh, look at that. Let me cut. Yes, I would like to cut that. You can talk to this dude. Can I get my fossil Pokemon, bud? Shh, listen, I need to share a secret with someone. I think that this chunk of amber contains Pokemon DNA. It would be a shattering scientific breakthrough if Pokemon could be resurrected from it. But my colleagues just ignore what I have to say, so I have a favor to ask. I want you to get this examined at a Pokemon lab somewhere. Okay, you just take it to a scientist, bruh. Okay, that's fine. I'll just take it to a scientist. 
We have two fossils of rare prehistoric Pokemon on exhibit. Secrets of space, mysteries of Earth, there's so many things about which we know little. So that should spur us to study, the only thing... Uh, how about Seismic Toss? Should I teach it to a Pokemon? Only once. Yes, Seismic Toss. Seismic Toss any good? Maybe I'll teach it later. Yeah, I'll, I'll be back. I don't, I don't, I don't want to rush into that right now. What about you? What are you going to say to me? You can't sneak in the back. Let's try, kid, but no. Do you know what Amber is? He's a general of ancient poet. That's the lab somewhere from Amber. Okay, so they literally said, hey, there's a lab somewhere. Um, We just, like, don't really care. Can you just, like, find out where it is and just, like, take it to them? Thank you. Okay, bud. All right. Anyway, let's go ahead. So I got to remember, Spiro at 20, Sancho at 22. Let's go ahead, and our main task is, of course, to catch a Clefairy, but our secondary task is to evolve uh, Spiro and Sandslash, just to, of course, fill out our Pokedex. Let's go ahead and go in inside of Mount Moon, and we're going to have to go through it, just like any other place again. Okay, guys. Oh. Oh. We did it. There's the Clefairy. All right. We have made it. Let's, um... I know this is, like, a wait. I'm just gonna chuck my Great Ball at it, dude. For real? Like, this thing is a 1%. I'm straight up just, like, not even playing her. That sucks. Not... Oh, no, dude. Didn't even... It shook once. Oh, that's a waste of a Great Ball. Alright, well, let's go ahead and throw a normal Pokeball, and if it doesn't work, then we'll go ahead and try to lower its health a little bit, but... Alright, let's lower its health. Encore, but it failed, yeah, because I didn't use a move. Go ahead and scratch it. Okay, Scrowl, that's actually good. Go ahead and scratch it again. Oh, now I'm attracted to it. Fetch Wild Freeze Growl. That's fine. Alright, let's go ahead and throw one more Pokeball, see what happens. Zoink. Two. Three. There we go. Go Fairy! Alright, that took a little while. I actually have Spiro. Um, with its magical and cute appeal, it has many admirers. It is rare and found only in certain areas. Give a nickname? No, I do not want to give it a nickname. I've actually, um, Spiro's at evolving level. Um, so let's go ahead and, might as well, while I'm talking, let's go ahead and try to evolve Spiro. Oh, but yeah. Let's go ahead and throw a water gun. Super effective. Okay. Alright, level 20. There we go. We should be able to get an evolution off of that. Very nice. And then Sandshrew will be 22. So I've got a little bit, I've got a little while to go with Sandshrew, but at least we can get this Spiro evolution roll in here. Bu -bu -bu -bu. And we got Spiro. Congratulations, your Spiro evolved into a Fero. Cool. Alright, well, now, time to put Sandshrew back in, and, um, I'm gonna sit here and grind for a while and get Sandshrew. Okay, everybody, I think we're very, very close to getting Sandshrew up to Sandslash. So we're level 21, and we are very close here, I think. All right, and that is level 22, and we will be getting our prized sand slash here, and another evolution to put on our little checklist, our Pokedex. There 
There we go, and we got ourselves a Sand Slash, which is um, another one of my favorites from this um, generation. Now, I don't know if I'll be using him, but it's definitely one of my favorites. And now, while I'm here, I do have to catch another Abra. Here is an Abra. Um, so we just need to simply catch it. Now, the problem with these Abras is they tend to like to run away, as you saw before. So likely, I won't be able to catch this one. Knowing my luck, it'll probably be... This one, psych. Just kidding. My luck is great. Alright, so there we go. Um, let me pull up my little notepad here of things that I have to do. Um, so we went to Mount Moon, got Clefairy, I went and got an Abra. Alright, well, we are good to go to take on the third gem. So, we're gonna go ahead and make our voyage over there. Um, we'll hear all the Pokemon when we get there, too. And I think what we're gonna end up doing is, let's go ahead and... I don't know if I'll finish the gym today, but let's definitely do some of it. Oh, um, I could check on Mankey? Let's check on Mankey, just to kind of see what he's up to. Totally forgot I left him in here. I wonder if he'll tell me. Your Mankey has grown a lot. Yes, quite a lot, I'd say. Let's see, by its level, it's grown by 10? Aren't I great? You owe me... Wow, that's... A lot of money. Okay, then let's go to withdraw. We gotta put one back in there. And I think it would be probably wise of us to give him a magic harp to hold on to so we can evolve that into a Gyarados later. So, let's go ahead and grab our Mankey back. Aren't I great? Yomi. Okay, let's go ahead and grab that back. I've got on the day. Okay, would you like me to raise? Yeah, let's go, let's go ahead and um. Okay, Mankey's 25, so we need three more levels, and we can get Primate. So, honestly... Um, no. Fine, come anytime you like. Let's go ahead and, um, it's only three levels for Primate. So, why don't we go ahead and train him while we're at it? So, let's go down to the gym. Alright guys, one more fight, and really, we should be able to evolve uh, Mankey here. So, let's go ahead and um, do this last fight together. So, level 27, very, very close. We can go ahead and do a Karate Chop. Will this one-shot it? It'll one-shot it. Look at that. Mankey is growing. Alright, and level 28. And I attribute all this to the Daycare Man for the 10 whole levels. What? Mankey is evolving? See, I definitely want to utilize a daycare man. You know, why not? It's, you know, he got us a free primate. Well, free by free, I mean a thousand one hundred dollar primate. But he saved me a little while of grinding, you know. And there we go. We have our primate. Another pretty, pretty cool Pokemon evolved into primate. It's trying to learn rage, but primate can't learn more than four moves. Delete a move. Yeah, let's go ahead and delete. Um, probably Fury swipes. I don't really need Fury Swipes. I know it's the only normal move we have, but I just don't see it being super, super useful. Okay, so, um, that is everything. Yeah, I wasn't expecting for to do Mankey today, but he was so close, I had to do it. Let's go ahead and fix our box here. So let's go ahead and, um, well, first we gotta figure out who we wanna withdraw. We could probably withdraw... I don't even know who we need. I guess Geodude? Geodude can come along? Everyone else can stay. Okay, so that's fine. Um... Yeah, why not? Geodude's pretty cool. We'll, we'll hopefully catch some more new ones pretty soon. Considering we're gonna head to some new places after this gym. We've kind of been stuck in this area for like a couple episodes here. Not really been able to catch new things, that's why I've been trying to, you know, fill the gaps to evolutions. But, now we can go ahead and head over to this gym. Gotta cut it. And, let's take a look. Yo, champ in the making. Lieutenant Surge is a nickname. People refer to him as the Lightning American. He's an expert on electric Pokemon. Bird-Water type Pokemon match poorly against the electric type. 
You wear paralysis too, and the surge is very cautious. He's locked himself in, so it won't be easy getting to him. Okay, let's see how many trainers we got in here. Okay, we got a few. Let's go ahead and take on one. Actually, I want to take on this guy. I'm a lightweight, but I'm good with electricity. That's why I joined this gym. Let's take on one dude. Let's just see what they got. Engineer Bailey. Okay, he's got two. He's got Voltorb. Oh, I don't even know who I have in my first slot. Oh, I still have Primeape. Okay. Well, hey, we haven't seen him in action yet, so let's go ahead and... Um, Primeape, use Rage. What happens? Spark. I mean, I'm 28. Oh, that didn't even do much. It's building. Okay, let's go ahead and rage again. And it gets stronger every time I'm guessing I rage, which is pretty cool. Let's go ahead and uh, we'll do Karate Chop. Hit the ball right on the head. Then an eye poke. Ooh, that's a lot of XP. Engineer is about to use Magnemite. Yeah, let's go ahead and change. Why don't we switch to Geodude? Obviously, no Geodude's not going to fight. But let's go ahead and switch him in. We could probably get a level up from it. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, um, switch him right out. And let's go ahead and go to Needle King. Needle King could probably take care of this Magnemite. Use Sonic Boom. Alright, don't confuse me. Alright, let's go ahead and Thrash. It's a dark move, so it should be... Oh, never mind. Not effective. Ah, you suck. Use Thrash again. I should be able to kill him. Alright, so... Um, the gym is around level 21, 22. It's not the worst thing on the planet. And we got Geodude to level up. Oh, we got him two level ups. Look at that, because he was... I guess we caught him when he was pretty low at Mount Moon. Okay, guys, I think we're going to end today's episode off here. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and comment on this channel, and I'll see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.